Hey YouTube, it's Posh Queen Dan and yes, I'm back. I know I've been gone for a really, really long time. Um, I can't even remember the last time I did this video, but I just want to say thank you to everyone that has still been supporting my channel, um, still been watching my videos, still been subscribing. I'm up to, I'm not really sure, I'm, I'm over 2,000. Um, subscribers by now and that is extremely exciting um i know one of the last videos i did was about a giveaway and that's when i had 500 subscribers but um i am going to still do a giveaway um i'm not going to do one for 500 um obviously because i've gone way past that but those prizes that i was going to give away um i'm going to give away that in more so stay tuned for that. Um, I'm gonna make some more video. Well, I'm gonna make another video um, explaining the details about that. Uh, let's see. Graduated from college, and now I am a cosmetology student at Paul Mitchell School. So I'm loving every single minute of that. Let me know if you want me to make a video um, about cosmetology school um, if you're looking to uh, make hairstyling a career choice um, I would love to make a video explaining you know the journey that I took um, to make the decision that I did and the school that I chose so let's get down to business I know it was crazy because one side of my hair is wavy and the other side of my hair is straight Sorry if this white tank top is winding you, um, but this is the best white I can find at my work in department, so I gotta manage. Um, this is a hair review for Hair Bar 100, and uh, I'm wearing the Virgin Indian Wave Hair. Well, it's body wave hair. I've been wearing this hair for about three and a half weeks now. I think it's about three and a half weeks. The first time Did a sew in. So that's what I'm wearing right now. I'm not wearing any part wig. I'm wearing a sew in, and I've been wearing that for the last three weeks, I think. The last two and a half weeks. Yeah, the last two and a half weeks. So, this right here is the natural um, state of the hair. Right here, it's the wavy after you wash it. Of course, when you get it, it comes in that natural S wave. Not natural S wave, that like process looking S wave. That you see most of these body wave textures coming in but when you wash it it has a really nice pretty natural wave which I was really impressed by that because usually when a company says that they have body wave hair it comes in that S wave and then you wash it and it's almost like natural straight hair which is like the biggest upset to think that you're getting wavy hair and then you wash it and it's wavy at all so I did really like I do really like the um, natural wave and that's how I've been mostly wearing it um, so far I haven't really been wearing it straight I really just straightened it for this video video purposes as you can see it straightened really well and this is like a quick straighten in you know kind of large section and it was like one pass so it's really easy um, to straighten. I have in about four bundles. Well, not the total four bundles. I have about three and three fourths of all of that hair. I have a 24, a 22, a 20, and an 18. And I just, you know, 18, 20, 22, 24. And, you know, I really have been enjoying this hair. I usually wear my hair straightened and curled. So I have been enjoying, like, the wake up and well, not really like you know, but just wake up refresh the way and go and just touch up the front of my hair. Um, I have been really enjoying that because I haven't worn my hair like that before. I usually just wear like the big curls. Uh, what else can I say about this hair? It does blend really well with African American hair. I'm natural. I don't get really serious. And it blends really well with my hair. 
it blends really well. Honestly, I felt like this hair was a little like Brazilian hair. I was really surprised that this uh, Indian hair because usually Indian hair is really greasy and thin and stringy looking. So I was happy to see that um, there is some Indian hair out there that has a really good quality. So if you're looking to try something different, I know like this whole Brazilian craze has been going on for a little while now. So if you're trying to go, you know, I would like to try something different. You know, this is some good hair to try. Um, some of the cons, this hair does need moisture. Um, so deep conditioning treatment, um, moisturizing shampoo, um, argan oil. Um, that's what this hair needs because it will get dry on you. And dry hair is not happy hair in this situation. So. I did have to learn that this is not just some hair that you can just wake up and just, you know, think that it's going to be perfect to have some refreshing and put some moisture in the hair because it, like, drinks the oil. Like, I've never seen anything like it, which is not a complete bad thing. Um, it's not a terrible thing. It's not like a, a um... It doesn't, it's not a deal breaker. That's what I want to say. It's not a deal breaker. Uh, you just have to moisturize the hair. You have to moisturize your own hair. So, and this is not like these five star hair where you can get out the pack and it's just, you know, nice. You have to put some moisture into the hair. I've been using the one and only Argan Oil and the Palm Mitchell Olive Fruity Wild Ginger Styling. been using the Owl Puli uh, Moisture Mist to refresh my curls in the morning. I do have another video that I'm going to post on how I refresh this hair. Uh, I'm going to put that up too. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to put it before this one or after this video, so just look out for that. Um, so oh, my other kind is that this hair when I made my new part wig with the hot glue gun, I did have to cut the west of my hair. So this hair is sliced and diced like all throughout. Um, so I can't really say that the shedding is due to the quality of the hair. I do have to take, you know, part of the blame or most of the blame for the shedding because one, I didn't feel my west, and two, I cut them up and chopped them up. So. Um, most of the shedding, I'm sure, is my fault. So I can't blame that on the hair at all. So if you are to pur purchase this hair, I definitely would suggest that you seal your web to um, make sure that you're um, getting minimal shedding and that you, you know, take care of your investment. Um, other than that, she has some really great hair. Uh, she has a straight texture, she has a body wave texture, and she also has curly hair um, that looks really pretty. Um, I'm kind of a little scared to get curly hair. It's, curly hair is so high maintenance. But uh, she has some really good textures. She is located in Memphis, Tennessee. So if you live there, uh, check her out. She delivers the hair uh, in her city. Uh, the prices on this hair, I mean, it's not cheap. It's a little bit on the higher end side, so, um, you know, that's something to consider when making a purchase like this, but it is really pretty here, so, it's not like it's completely overpriced, it's kind of average on the, the higher end brand um, that you're seeing now, but...
think I'm done with mine. Well, that would be maybe my hiatus. My YouTube hiatus. Um, I got some plans, some video ideas coming up. But if you have any more, even if you all are always uh, welcome to leave suggestions in the comment box below. Make sure you thumb me up. Make sure you subscribe. And make sure you add me on Twitter. Yeah, follow me on Twitter and at me on Instagram. Both of my names are Posh Glam Jan.